the first thing we want to talk about is what is an oscillation and also what is SHM. Now, an oscillation is anything or any object that goes back and forth and always tries to return to some equilibrium position. So for example, we like to use pendulums, right? If we, of course, left the pendulum on its own, it'll just lie on a vertical line. But if you displace this pendulum over here, for example, what will it do? It will then move back here, right? And then it would move beyond the equilibrium position because it has momentum, and then it comes back here. And so you notice that this object, the pendulum, always tries to make its way back towards equilibrium. And so we say that there is a restoring force. So an oscillating object is simply one that always returns to equilibrium because there will always be a restoring force. However, if I talk about SHM, this is of course simple harmonic motion, we should think of SHM as a special kind of oscillation. So if I drew this as a Venn diagram, oscillations would be here, SHM would occupy a very small part of it. And so an SHM is basically an oscillation that has this additional condition where the acceleration of your oscillating object must be directly proportional to the displacement from equilibrium. Interesting. And so you can think of it this way, right? If this is equilibrium and I'm here, a certain displacement x, then my a would be large as compared to here where my x is smaller and so my a would be smaller over here. So if you think about it, let's summarize the facts. Okay, an SHM is an oscillation where A is directly proportional to X and A is always directed to equilibrium. An oscillation only has this condition, but not this one. 